Okay, so I got some springs here, and we're going to be building some tools for the, the barbecue grill that I have. This half-inch rod, so the springs are half-inch openings. This one's zinc-coated. This one's stainless steel. $299, $399. Um, these are $425. And these three-inch caps are 209 That's going to be for the little rake, and let me do the other cuts. And that will give me the radius that I need. Yeah, it looks close. Well, metal's getting warmer, so I got my gloves. I still gotta put two little spikes in there, but I'm gonna go ahead and clean up the weld. And I'm gonna see if I can make it look a little bit nicer. I'm gonna crank down the, the heat a bit over there on the, on the welder. Now this ain't that pointy, but um, now I gotta do like a little, kind of like a little harpoon here, something to be able to drag something back. 
you know, something like that. So this I'll poke and this will kind of help me to drag bag or, or kind of, you know, twist the lock around. I've seen people put another one like this forward, but uh, I'm going to go this way just as one little spike, and we should be good. Let me get another uh, electrode ready. And again, we're using the same ones. It's pretty windy out here today. We got a storm coming in, so I'm trying to get this done. I don't know if it's gonna be a, a hurricane or a tropical storm. But it don't matter, I'm gonna keep oiling. Those are little two spikes I put on there to hold the onion in place. Just slap the onion in there and then it's great. So I'm gonna let these cool down and then I'm gonna paint them. So I got some high heat paint. The wind started to pick up. Um, we got a storm coming in so I wanna paint these. And uh, <laughs> All right. Now, I was thinking about spray painting all this and then uh, that way the, the little bar can have paint and then use like a paint there to, you know, to leave this uh, that chrome color. It doesn't bother me either for me anyways. I'll be using this in a few minutes. Got the fire going. We're going to use a fire poker right now. I think a lot of people add the other one here on the front in case I want to push something like a cooking grate or a log. And um, I just didn't want to kind of pull, you know, pull a log or, or a cooking grate. This one slides out that way, but, you know, if it was sliding out this way, I can use that to pull the cooking grate as well. So that's one down. So I got this, my cooking grate cleaner, and an onion. So basically I just insert the onion here, like so. And then when I'm done, I just grab the onion, throw it away, and hang my cooking rake cleaner. One thing about the onion, it gives a lot of uh, aroma versus the other one that's just like that. But uh, that's how it works.